All right, this is something I've been waiting for forever. Um, this is the iOS version of Waifu 2X. It has been ported to the Mac App Store um, via Catalyst, and it works so well. So I've been using the Mac OS version by the same developer, um, and it works great. It's really fast, it's really easy to use. Um, it's a little limited in its Mac OS version as, as the application, you have to go through command line. With the iOS version, um, it's, it's a lot more robust. Um, there's actually a couple more options, a little more control. Um, it's not perfect, and I'll point out some of the issues uh, as we do this test sequence here. So we're gonna do next. This is the, we can pick our model, which is really nice. This is the higher quality model. Uh, we're gonna do noise level one. We're gonna do upscale uh, just two times for brevity's sake. Start, we're gonna pick our output directory which is gonna be waifu2x catalyst, open. And we'll open that up over here. Off it goes, look, it's already, look how fast, just look how fast it's going. This is an iOS app, uh, just to give you the specs of the computer we're working on, this is an iMac 2019 5K um, Core i9 with a Vega 48 GPU. It's a decent computer, and I, I love this computer, but it's not the most powerful thing out there. And this app, I guess, technically isn't even optimized for it. So I can only imagine what it'll be like on an M1. Um, if I have to put a couple of slight complaints, um, these files are still, are unfortunately 8-bit. What I was feeding it was 16-bit uh, files, which is a shame because like the cafe version on the Mac, or sorry, on Windows, you can keep um, the 16-bit nature of your files but just, just look how speedy it's going. It's just, it's just going so fast. I'm just, I'm ecstatic that this version of Waifu 2X has finally come over to the Mac because it's just so good. And, you know, I know it's only gonna get better because, you know, I, I'm hoping that he adds 16-bit uh, images to this workflow, maybe video someday, I doubt that, but I can live without that. And just having this work as well as it does, I mean, we're already almost done. We're done, I think. I think we already finished. We finished, we're done. That's that. Um, you know, there, it's not perfect. There's still some work left to do, but for what is essentially an iOS app coming to the Mac and just being this efficient, this good this easy to use is, is so so great uh can't wait to see more it is 4.99 on the mac app store but a hundred percent worth it it's just this guy deserves it if you want to try the mac os version on um he, you can go to his github and download that it's absolutely free but i really recommend the mac os version and he totally deserves to get payment for this